Hello and welcome to Show That Glow with Katie. I'm here today to do another product review. I'm in my daughter's bedroom again. Yes, I've been tidying, as you can tell. So today I am doing a product review on a new foundation that I have just got my hands on. It's fair to say I'm a bit scared because I have one foundation. I absolutely love it, don't get me wrong, and it is the Matte Clay Skin Clarifying Foundation from Body Shop. Absolutely love it, use it on my clients, use it on myself, use it, I literally recommend it to everybody and anybody. And I'm still a bit heartbroken that, they've, that, that they're getting rid of it. It's gone, it's gone. But still, we are here and I need to try a new foundation because I need something that's going to give me the exact same coverage. So, I need a mirror. Don't think I've got one. So bear with me. I'm going to go get a mirror. Okie dokie. Right. I'm back. I have my mirror. So, what I'm going to do is... Sorry. Quick wait. I'm going to show you exactly what it is. So this is the new Fresh Nude Foundation from Body Shop. It's absolutely beautiful. It's like a really beautiful, like, um, misted glass. can't remember the exact word. It's a bit like sea glass, where it's, like, really misty looking and foggy looking. It's really, really cute. But, anyway, so a bit of knowledge on this foundation. It is vegan. It's also got 95% natural origin of ingredients, which is amazing. Who doesn't want something that's actually natural rather than chemicals? We don't want chemicals on a face. Bloody marketers. Well, anyway, it's also 100% recyclable packaging, which means you empty this whole bottle, clean it out, pop it in your recycle bin. Bob's your uncle. Hey, old Bob. But this is recyclable, which means it's also friendly for the environment. A massive, massive, massive thing for me. So, not only that, it's also really hydrating. It's enriched with aloe vera, which, as we know, is really good for skin, as well as vitamin E. And because it is a water-based foundation, it also gives up to 24 hours. 24 hours, man of hydration for your skin. So, shall we have a look at C, and C, not it's C, and C, this bad boy, in freaking progress. Yes, let's have a look. Right, so, just gonna take this. Look at the tip. Oh, oh it's like a heart shape. It's like, love me already. So I'm just putting a bit on my hand. I've already colour matched. So I know it's my shade. It's beautiful because you can there's so many different shades now. I think there's about 40 shades. And this is light 2N, if you can see that. So I'm gonna get my lovely trusted beauty blender and we will blend away. So <sighs> Dead nervous. I'm dead nervous. Right, we're gonna do this side, okay? All right. It doesn't look too bad. I'm gonna do half my face so I can see the difference. So far, it's not too bad. Um, I'm liking it so far. Need a bit more though. Seeing as this is mine, we'll do it straight on the face. Ooh, I don't want it falling all over me. Right, so do it on the forehead. A bit more on the cheek. A little bit on the nose. A little bit on the eye. And on the chin. That should be plenty, shouldn't it? Should be plenty. You watch, I've overestimated this. Right. I 
I will be testing this out, you know, body shop. Maybe a consultant, but I need to check. I need to check everything. So it's not matte, I can tell by that. Because my, my face is looking very, very shiny, which is one of the things about it, it is a light reflecting foundation. So it makes the light bounce off you. So it gives you the more of that dewy looking skin. I don't like dewy looking skin. As much as I prefer it on my clients, and I do do it on special occasions for my makeup looks, I do prefer having mattified skin. I do not like having shiny skin just because I have a very oily face as it is. I really don't want, you know, I don't want to look shinier. I'll end up being attracted by uh, that crab from Moana. Shiny. So, how are we looking? Okay, okay. I've got to say it. It's not matte. It is not matte skin clarifying clay foundation. But, it's not bad. It's not bad. It really is so light on my skin. <sighs> really lightweight and it doesn't feel like it's clogging anything it just genuinely feels like my skin is soft it feels really subtle oh i love it don't get me wrong it's not full coverage i know that it's medium coverage it's not light to medium it's medium it's not full coverage but i can always do that myself with a bit of concealer and a matte powder on top but for my new foundation, I'm quite impressed. What do you guys think? Because personally, I'm quite quite chuffed with coverage, to be fair. To say that's medium. Definitely, it's definitely my skin tone. Definitely, 100% that's my skin tone. I've colour matched really well for that because I've checked it with my old foundation as well as everything else. And don't get me wrong, I do like how it makes my skin look very glowy. But as someone that doesn't like oily skin myself, because I have oily skin every now and again, yeah, I do need to mattify it. But I'm really happy with that. I am. I'm super happy. The coverage is really decent. Say it's medium coverage and it's buildable. You can always build up on the layers the way you know you need more product um it's really easy to apply it's not like it's hard work or anything like that it's you know it's just standard foundation put it on always put it on the back of your hand don't put it on your face if you're going to use it on other people um i'm not going to be using this on other people this is mine all mine i'm officially Gollum from lord of the Rings. Yes, I am a nerd. Yes, I have watched Lord of the Rings. No, I can't remember most of it, but I remember Gollum. Done. But I am. I'm chuffed. I'm really, really chuffed with how that's come out. Um, I wasn't expecting that at all. I was expecting it to be, like, really, really crap coverage. I've got such faith in Body Shop. I really have. I have, honestly. But when it comes to foundation, I have to have the most amazing foundation so it covers everything and to say this is medium coverage it's incredible it really is incredible it's not covered everything i can still see a bit of redness there you know i can still see a bit of redness there i can still see a couple of marks you know um but it it is really really nice it's soft it's silky it's not it's not like really cakey like the matte clay can be quite thick feeling um but this feels like i've got nothing on it just feels like i've got my normal skin on and that's it nothing else it doesn't feel like it's going to come off with every touch 
So if I put a mask on, it doesn't it don't feel like it's going to whip off. But no, I love this. I really do love this. It really is really nice. And I'm going to have to take some before and after photos because this is brill. It really does. Oh, I'm in love. Well, thank you very much for joining me. Uh, this is the Fresh Nude Foundation. I do believe it's £18. I will double check that. If it's not £18, I'll put the normal price down there. Just dropped it there. So, uh, all I can say is, Body Shop, thank you for restoring my faith in Body Shop. Because I was absolutely mortified when I found out about the Matt Clay. But again, again, I'm really chuffed. I am. I'm really chuffed. Thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you really enjoyed the video. And I really, really do hope you all have a lovely day. And keep smiling as always.